Welcome back everyone, Criminal Archer here, time for some more Project Zomboid. So the keen-eyed of you right, viewers right at the end of the episode may have noticed that I woke up in the middle of the night. I think it's just a nightmare, but we're going to go check. I, did the power go out too? I think No, the power is not out, okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he just had a nightmare. Oh, but there, oh, no, there's a zombie in here. Maybe he didn't just have a nightmare. Yeah, hello. Anything else in here? No? Oh, that's the stairs. Alright, seem to be okay. Alright, let's just get this corpse out of here. Um, in the next day, close the door, please. Right, let's see if we can go to sleep. I'm gonna go. We're gonna go on a little road trip. I'm not tired enough to sleep. Oh, how's my how's my um, bandage? Yeah, that's gonna need to be clean. Oh, it's over. Never mind. Just put these two dirty bandages here for now. Might need them at some point in the future, but the moment I don't. Sleep? No, I want. I want to go to sleep. Let me go to sleep. Yeah, we're gonna go on a little road trip, which I guess we can get set for because apparently we're not gonna go back to sleep. So that's gonna require us getting filling one of these cars that we have accessible to us up with gas. Which I'm gonna go with this one just because it's more accessible, I guess. <laughs> Let's go back here. These two empty gas cans out. All right, where's the ne nearest car? Oh, probably, probably north. Oh, hello. Large group of zombies. Alright, apparently that car didn't have very much gasoline in it. This one will. Suppose we should deal with this guy first, huh? Oops. Knife broke. No, no, don't add gasoline. You have to be at just the right angle to do this, or is it? Is, it, is this trying to tell me that there is no gas in this car? Let's just be sure. Yeah, alright, so there's just no gas in that car. That was a decent amount. Also, this house looks to be in a weird in a weird state. Is it just like a glitch? Oh, it's not a glitch, but stupid house, stupid 
stupid alarms. Say, so expect that large group of zombies we saw to be heading this direction. To have a weapon in my hand. There we go. All right, I'll put these two empty gas things in here. And then we've got some stuff in the trunk. All right, we need to go get eat some breakfast. And then we're going to get on the road. We're going to the country club. I don't know if I said that before or not. I haven't been to the country club yet. I would like to go to the country club, so that's where we're going. Let's cook this. We still have power, so might as well use it while we do. Come on, finish, finish. All right, is there anything I can make with this? No, no, oh, whatever. I'm just gonna eat this, whatever. <laughs> Got a little bit of stuff on it. It's fine, we'll be fine. Full to bursting. Close our door, so hopefully no zombies are in our house when we come back. Come on, you stupid car. Alright, I mean, we've got half a tank of gas, so I'm hoping that that, I mean, in the real world, that'd be more than enough gas to get where we're going. I don't have a clue how fast we use gas in this game. <laughs> I haven't been doing cars long enough to know for sure. that we left something behind stuff is falling out of our trunk I don't know why but okay trunk latch is broken or something <laughs> Oh, there goes the other one. That's probably, you know that one time when we found random food along the along the road? That's probably what happened, is it fell out of the trunk of the car that I was on. I wonder if maybe you have to open and, like, close the trunk, and we've just not been doing that? Because I didn't realize that was a thing. Kind of a long drive, as drives go. I 
Can't imagine trying to run this though. Just a nice, uh, you know, late July drive through the countryside. We'll get there eventually. <laughs> oh, zombies. I wasn't expecting that. I'm getting kind of used to not seeing them around. Oops, sorry. A lot of them out here. Makes me slightly concerned about what we're going to meet when we get there. Yeah, there's a lot more zombies down here than I thought there were going to be. Looking for the next right, basically. Right there. There we go. Oh, I thought I'd be able to pull it off. Turning radius is not the right. Not the greatest. Driving down the wrong side of the street. Trying to make all my uh, UK viewers feel at home. Alright, you know what? We'll actually... No, I don't want to do that. I was going to say we'll leave the car here, but I don't want to do that. Let's work our way around here. There we go. Hopefully it's just straight up, straight up this road. Here we go. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. There's the pool. I wonder if you could fish in the pool. Alright, here we are. So, lock all doors. Open the windows? Interesting. Alright, so, was I supposed to do something with the trunk? Glove box, radio. Driver's seat. Just trying to see if there's something like that says like trunk door broken. Trunk forty seven percent. Yep, I bet that's what that is. But that means that it's broke. It's not uh, working so great. Okay, no, no alarm. <laughs> I was waiting to see if there was an alarm that was gonna go off. door. They know I've got looting to do. Stupid locked doors. And I have an axe. I can I can deal with this situation. Forging. Pretty sure I basically have all the books I care about. In the trash can? Oh. 
All right, let's try to be at least vaguely systematic about this. Yeah, come back and break that door down later. It's like a ballroom. There's a zombie knocking on the wall over there. Whiskey. I'm gonna drink this. Cause why not? More booze. Booze it up. Ooh, hello. Nails. Some loose nails I saw somewhere. Some point we're probably gonna need that charcoal that we keep seeing around and ignoring. Or we'll die first, one of the two. Yeah, this should let you do some sort of like charcoal filtration system. That'd be neat. That's outside. Racquetball? You want to play some racquetball? Maybe some handball? There are multiple balls that this could be. Trash. Key to something. My clothes doing, by the way. Dirty. Let's wear these. Drop that. Keep a look out for some clean shoes. Those looks like some clean shoes. Find it unlikely that this lady is the same size as me, but whatever. <laughs> Suspension of disbelief, right? I saw another school bag in there, but so this is like the this is the actual yeah this was this area. This is very disappointing uh, in terms of the behind the locked doors part of this building. Upstairs. Kitchen. I'd like to find, it would be nice to find that whatever is making that uh, beeping noise right now. Or not beeping noise, the tone. I'm trying to eat that watermelon slice is throwing an error for me for some reason. There we go. Beef. Or knife. Another cooking pot. Peanut, peanut butter, popcorn. That's not how that song goes. There you are. I really, really still could use new bags. 
Yeah, it's one of the big things. Big, big, big issues at the moment. Oh, that's not where I want to go. It's really limiting. It's inhibiting inhibiting our uh, looting potential. Bathroom. Is this you? No, you're turned off. Oh, it's in here. Bag? No bag. Bag? Soda. Take that, nothing there. Some sort of meeting room, kind of useless. Another sort of meeting room. And another. And another. Ooh, security office. Also kind of useless. Oh, zombies! Zombies! Another key. And a banana that I'm gonna eat right now. Tea bag, sugar. Zombie behind the counter. It's rotten bread. Suppose we can make a cuppa. Got a tea bag, we got a kettle. Just need some water. Ice cream, huh? I'm gonna eat that. Okay, 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 okay. Billiards room. All right, so clearly we're not going to finish this all, this whole thing in one sitting. So I'm going to stop here for today, and I will pick it up in the next one. See you guys later.